My name is Jordan Nadell, and I started skiing when I was five years old. That was 45 years ago. I started racing NASTAR when I was about 13. NASTAR is a great way for an average person to, to experience the thrill of ski racing. You're not racing against the other competitors, you're racing against the clock and against yourself. And medals are given out for each participant. That is until you get to the nationals. Then you go against the best in the country. We started our boys skiing when AJ and Ryan were seven years old and Evan was four years old. They began with a lesson at Jack Frost Mountain. Hi, my name is Evan Nadell and I've been skiing for 10 years and I am 14. I've been to nationals three times now. Um, I placed 18th, 8th, and 5th. So my name's Ryan um, and I've been skiing since I was seven years old. Uh, and recently I started doing coaching in the Jack Frost race program. So the last time I went to nationals, uh, I finished fourth overall in my age category and I placed first in the state in my age category. So I'm AJ Nadell, um, and I've been skiing since I was seven. I'm Ryan's twin brother. Uh, so this year I started coaching, at, and um, I'm doing private lessons like my dad. And it's really different from anything I've ever done in skiing because you don't only have to watch out for yourself. You also have to look out for the way that the people you're teaching are skiing. It's actually really good preparation for NASTAR because you can't just focus on yourself. You have to focus on the course. So you just kind of have to think of the people you're teaching as the course. In November of 2013, I was diagnosed with non-arteritic ischemic optic neuropathy. It's a disorder of the optic nerves where they get swollen and ultimately loss of vision occurs. I'm legally blind in my left eye and the doctor said skiing would be a challenge. But skiing to me is therapy. It's a way of relaxing, and enjoying the outdoors. To prepare for nationals this year and well, first qualifying, uh, I've been working out almost every day. I've been doing Muay Thai with my dad. Uh, I've done martial arts in the past before that. Uh, it's really good physical conditioning. I've also done parkour and free running uh, and just a bunch of general fitness things that'll help me get ready for the race. <laughs> line it was like a weight off my shoulders i finished my run now it's all on the other I think I put down the best run I possibly could. 
I was roughly three seconds off the pace setter, which is the Mountain Professionals time. And I, I believe I qualified for nationals with a 25 handicap, which would put me in the silver division. So in the qualifying race, I ended up um, beating out the rest of my family who did the race, uh, which is something I haven't been able to accomplish in the past. Um, so I think it's a pretty big step forward for me. When we went down, I won a gold medal, which I've only ever done, or at least a NASDAQ gold medal, two other times in my 10 years of skiing. So I'm very happy with that. So I got the slowest time of us all, um, but I got a silver medal, uh, and I think my run was enough to qualify me. So I'm just gonna have to beat them where it counts when we actually get to nationals. Dad ended up finishing first in his age group qualifying. Ryan and I got second and third, and Evan finished fourth in his age group. 